Welcome to the Bali and Shelly Show, where we unpack the products one product at a time. Awesome. So today's product focus is going to be our Liquid Molly Breaking Pots Cleaner, and uh, this is a, a high pressure solvent, being able to clean grease and oil stains on any components. So the Break and Part Cleaner is a product that is uh, one of our top, top sellers and it has so many uses and not just in your workshop, but also at, at your home. And we're going to quickly cover a couple of those so that you have a good idea where you would use this product in all areas of your life. Okay, so fundamentally this is a degreaser, so in a workshop environment where you want to use it always on the brake systems, uh, especially on the brake pads and calipers to remove the, the carbon dust accumulation to ensure it's nice and clean and when you fit that again um, you can actually use this. But we have a different few components as well here, so this is actually from a bicycle workshop. Uh, that you can see it's quite oily um, components here, we've got a little pedal and also a, a little uh, gear set. Right, so if Manisha, you can maybe spray me there. <laughs> I can spray you. So what you'll see is a high pressure solvent as we discussed. Right, and ultimately what it's going to do, it's going to remove all the oily stains and grease from it. And also you can see it evaporates very quickly. Right, so that's one key benefit of this product as well. So absolutely wonderful to be able to clean your chain because of the high pressure. The brakes is what Shelly just mentioned. Um, little pieces and uh, 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 um, parts that you also want to clean. And the magic of it is that you don't have to remove it or wash the brake and part cleaner off afterwards. So it is a product that you can then clean and just then make sure that you can um, uh, assemble again or apply then your lube if it's a chain or put the brakes back on. A place in the workshop that they also love using this because this product is available in 5 litres and in 60 litres then they are not under pressure so it's not going to come out in high force but it's great if you have to wash an engine mm. and clean parts that you can actually put it in a little bucket, dip it, bring it out, it's going to take all the greasiness out and it's going to evaporate very very quickly so that you can immediately start working on that part or that engine um, as soon as it's dried up. One amazing thing as well, this is very cost effective and as Mel mentioned, it's a way easier solution to clean components to make your life so simple. Yeah, so in a workshop condition, we've just mentioned um, how to utilize it, but in a home environment. So we as South Africans absolutely love our braai flakes and a lot of the times wanting to see if the braai is actually in the vault is um, ready to, to be eaten. Uh, you put the knife or the fork in there and the fattiness goes all over. So to be able to give a little bit of an idea if this would happen to your clothing and how easy it is to use the brake and part cleaner. Okay, so uh, hopefully your vault is not going to spray like <laughs> this. But Shelly, if you can then spray it to me so that you can see. So normally you would put this in the washing machine. You will have it, a see-through experience afterwards. This, even just by spraying it on like this, just take a little bit for us outside, um, Shelly, just so that you can see from the top and clean it up. A second. So just spray it. Okay, just the top part. You can see that the black is going off. Yeah, on this side, see how it all falls down to the to going to the bottom. Now, if all of the parts that have been contaminated with oil, you have actually sprayed it with a brake and ball cleaner. You can take this cloth, um, clean everything else with it, <laughs> <laughs> and throw it in the washing machine. It's not going to damage the color and it is going to take that oiliness away. So even if you have little spots all over because of the, the fattiness or you've cooked, and you've got fat all over you, you can just spot spray everywhere. Don't worry about the material. It is going to come out as soon as you've thrown it into the washing machine. Awesome. So another alternative is around a campfire. And if you don't have uh, fire lighters, uh, you can always use this. So just to create a bit of a mood with your friends and family. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> <laughs> okay, so, so, so what we're trying to illustrate here is that it's very flammable. It's extremely flammable. <laughs> so please, I just want to tell you that this is not a party trick that you should do. It's just to it's illustrate the, the fact that it is very, very, very flammable. flammable. So if you would put in a little bit of, of newspaper and, and spray it and put it in the fire, make sure you've got one of those, those um, uh, lighters that actually have uh, quite a big extension. A reach, yeah. Otherwise, I'm going to put a little bit in there and Shelly, I'm going to ask you to do it. <laughs> Okay, so um, it's going to, uh, hopefully this thing at the bottom is not plastic. <laughs> <laughs> we like to b blow things up, um, but it's very, very flammable. So please keep that into, in consideration uh, when you use the brake and part cleaner. When we see this, the other really, really awesome tip for brake and part cleaner, if you have weeds in between your, um, on your pavement, spray them with brake and part cleaner 
and light it up. It's going to burn all those weeds and then you're going to just be able to afterwards when they're nice and dry, just even with a, little, with a broom, scrape them away. No more weeds. So liquid molly break and part cleaner, so many different uses. <laughs> melting stuff and breaking things up <laughs> but safe to use it will not damage any paint mm. and it is a very popular product to clean your chain anything that's greasy and at home to make sure that you take all the stains out of your clothing and also to make sure you get rid of the weeds or like Shelly said start that nice campfire um, if you have forgotten all your fire lighters <laughs> so this product is an acetone free product and it helps to prevent uh, paint damage as Manisha mentioned um, but also helps uh, not to damage any seals uh, when it comes to components and uh, bearing systems which is quite important because you don't want to spray it somewhere where you're going to have those seals that are going to expand and um, uh, uh, perforate afterwards so a very safe product to be able to use in all different areas and make your life so much easier Liquid Molly, break and part cleaner. Thank you very much for watching the Melly and Shelly Show.